Hey everyone, what's up? My name is Chris from whoschrishughes.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to switch your hosting from HostGator, which is what I used to use, to now I'm switching over to Bluehost because HostGator was down for an entire day yesterday and completely ruined uh, opportunity for me to make a lot of money. So what I decided to do is just switch over to Bluehost and uh, if you go below this blog post you'll see some of the reasons why I'm doing that but this is all about how to actually switch over all your domains so once you log in to Bluehost after you sign up at the link below you'll see this is the back office that you'll keep see and what happens right when you start up there's a getting started wizard pops up and it says you can click on it so you just click on that and what you're going to do is you're going to be redirected to this page right here uh, all you gotta do is, you'll see here, verifying your Bluehost account, validating the account, you'll just click that little blue section, and you can see here, how can I verify the purchase? And all you have to do is call the department, or you can use email. I'm just gonna call right now, and then I'll be right back on the video for you. Okay, so I just got off the phone, it took me about 35 seconds to get verified, so that was very quick. I like that. Uh, let's see, we're going to go back to the Getting Started Wizard since we are now verified. Uh, transfer clients is the next step, so host your existing domain. What I'm going to do is just click that. And transfer domain registration. All we have to do is change the name servers to point to your hosting account and what I'm going to do is log into my GoDaddy account which is where I actually purchased the original domains and change the name servers to the new ones that are given. So I'm going to do that right now. And if you do, if you use GoDaddy you can follow the directions I'm doing right here. Do here domains, you can do a little drop down there. And you'll see here there's a whole list of a bunch of the domains I have right now. What I'm going to do is just click the checkbox here and just click select all domains. And then at this point you'll see the name servers and you'll go to set name servers. And you'll see here I have specific name servers for my domains. You're going to cl click that box. I'm going to go back to the other and copy the updating name servers information here. Name server one set up. Name server two set up, and I'm just going to click OK. It says these changes usually take two hours. However, it may take up to 48 hours for these changes to take effect. These are estimates, so you got to wait some time for these changes to all fully be, you know, gone through. But there we go for that. Those are all transferred over, and. Now it's going to just take some time for everything to process, and that's the simplest way you could possibly transfer your domains. I just did the bulk and changing the name servers, so that's it. And if you want to get hosting, I definitely am recommending Bluehost right now. I have just bought a year subscription for them, so I'm going to try it out and see, but I've only heard good things from them. And if you want to get hosting from Bluehost, there's going to be a link below the video on my blog that you can get you know, learn more about Bluehost on. So that's it. I hope this video helps you and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Have a great day.